Do you worry that emails sent from your WordPress site are not reaching their recipients? Order confirmations, subscription confirmations, and notifications often end up in spam, or worse, are not delivered at all. This problem is mainly caused by the default WordPress setting method, which doesn't authenticate messages. As a result, many email providers mark those emails as suspicious or unwanted. But there is a simple solution. It's called ProMail SMTP, a 100% free plugin that we've developed to give you a professional SMTP service on your WordPress site. It ensures emails are delivered correctly to inboxes and not to spam folders. Every day, tens of thousands of emails are sent from WordPress sites around the world. Order confirmations via WooCommerce, automatic response to complete forms, and much more. However, these emails are often sent via the server's PHP mail function, which doesn't offer authentication. As a result, email providers cannot verify the sender's identity, compromising the reliability of the communication. This can damage your site's reputation and directly impact your business. To avoid these problems, you should use an external SMTP, such as Turbo SMTP, or even services provided by competitors. These services authenticate emails and improve deliverability. There are already similar plugins for WordPress, such as WP Mail SMTP, which offers a free version but limits many features to paid plans. ProMail SMTP, on the other hand, is 100% free. It doesn't even require registration and lets you easily import settings from other plugins, making the transition quick and easy. If you already use WP Mail SMTP, you can simply import your providers and start working with a new plugin for free. I'll show you how to do that in another video in which I'll explain the difference between the two plugins. But what's the advantage of using an external SMTP and our ProMail SMTP plugin? As I explained, the main benefit is the ability to route emails through a professional SMTP service not attached to your WordPress site. You can choose between providers like SendGrid, Mailgun, Turbo SMTP, or even services like Gmail or Outlook. They'll also give you accurate reports about the mails you send. The default WordPress system offers no monitoring at all. But what are the main functions of ProMail SMTP? One of the most useful advanced features of our plugin is the routing system. Let me give you an example. If you use WooCommerce and want to send order confirmations with a reliable service like Turbo SMTP, which in the free version gives you 200 emails per day, you can configure a second provider like Gmail to manage secondary emails, such as thank you messages for signing up to a form. The second provider will help you stay below the daily limit on Turbo SMTP emails and let you optimize the free service. With a series of very simple rules that I'll show you in the tutorial, you can decide to assign specific providers to different types of emails or plugins. It's very cool. Another important function is automatic backups. If the first provider fails, for example, due to exhausted credit or technical problems, the plugin automatically attempts to send with the second provider. If this also fails, the third takes over, and so on, depending on the number of providers entered. And as a last resort, the standard PHP mail function is used. This way, you'll never lose an important message. Want to try the plugin? You can find the link to download ProMail SMTP for free from the WordPress store below. Now let's see how it works. Log in to your site's WordPress account. On the left menu, go to Plugins and click Add Plugin. Type ProMail SMTP in the search bar, then scroll until you find it. Click Install Now and Activate. Now click ProMail SMTP in the menu. If you've already added any providers or plugins for this feature, you'll see a notification for the import. Otherwise, click Add Provider. Select a provider. In this case, I select Turbo SMTP. Remember, 
Turbo SMTP gives you 200 free emails per day. Now, name this connection. To obtain the consumer key and the consumer secret password, log in to your Turbo SMTP account and click Settings. Click Edit under the API Keys heading. Now click Create API Key. Give the key a name so that you can remember what it's for. Then click Generate API Key. Copy the two codes into the required fields. Before closing this window, copy the consumer secret password and store it safely. If you lose that password, you'll have to generate a new key. Now, choose your region and the priority of the provider. Finally, click Add Provider and the connection will be completed. If you add another provider, such as Gmail, you can mark that provider Priority 2 during configuration. Turbo SMTP will always act first, but if it fails to send for any reason, your email will be sent by Gmail. Now click the Settings tab. Keep the check mark that enables PHP Mail fallback active. You'll need it if both Turbo SMTP and Gmail fail to send. Now I'll show you how to set conditions. Click the Email Router tab, then Add Router Condition. Give the condition a name. I'll call this Contact Form. If displays in the condition. In the first field, select the first phrase. Source app lets you select a specific plugin, but there are lots of other possibilities. For example, you can choose Subject if your condition focuses on a specific object, or select From Email if the condition is a specific email address. In this example, I chose Source App, and in the next field, I'm selecting the Contact Form 7 plugin. Now continue with Then. Activate the Send Email Using switch and select a provider, such as Gmail. So far, the instruction we've given is, if the source plugin is Contact Form 7, then use the Gmail provider to send. If you then add the Force Sender switch and type an email and a specific sender name, then the messages will all have the sender and email address I indicated. Finally, click Save and activate the switch to enable the condition you just created. Now let's create a second condition to send emails via Turbo SMTP, but only if they come up from the WP Forms plugin, which we use to create a more important subscription list than the generic contact form. Click Add Router Condition again. Give the rule a name and choose Source App again in the first field. Then select WP Forms. Now select Turbo as the provider. Once saved, you can decide to activate or deactivate the rules whenever you want. Setting your conditions in this way will let you allocate and balance your provider services. Now let's see the plugin in action. I complete a registration form on my WordPress site created with WP Forms. Submitting the form triggers a notification email. I check the ProMail SMTP and click the Email Logs tag. Here, an email sent with Turbo SMTP and the subject of the automatic email appear in the list. In this other tab, you can also see the provider's logs. If I filter the search and select Gmail, you can see that no emails have been sent from Gmail. As you can see, the service is really simple to use. It is an intuitive plugin and, I repeat, completely free. You just need to enter the parameters of your SMTP provider so you can start sending emails right away without the risk of your messages ending up in spam. If you want to try it, just use the link in the description below. Alternatively, you can search for the name of the plugin inside WordPress as we showed in the tutorial. Finally, if this video was useful to you, I invite you to subscribe to the Turbo SMTP channel and activate the bell so you don't miss our updates. And if you've already tried our plugin or have any questions, leave me a comment below.